Hey guys, what's going on? Culprit here. And today I'm going to do a little bit of an uh, update video if I may. I've uh, got a little bit of business I want to talk to you guys about, but I can't really kind of fit it into other videos, so I'm just going to kind of make a whole big update video and talk about it there. Uh, I'm not exactly sure what I'm using in the background yet. I'm thinking about maybe even using some Black Ops, just to switch it up a little bit, a little something different. First order of business, I want to talk about streaming. <laughs> I know I talked about this, what, probably January, end of December, and I was hoping it was imminent. Uh, obviously, I've had all kinds of delays. There's, I'm kind of in a little bit of a dispute with my ISP right now. I have a funny suspicion that they're throttling me. Um, I'm, I'm having a lot of weird things going on the last month or so. Uh, ironically enough, that's right when I started the other two channels, so I was uploading a lot more, and suddenly my, my service drops a lot, and, and moves a lot slower than it should. It's always been slow, but now it's moving even slower. So I've been kind of back and forth with them in contention, and, and there's been some things. So I haven't wanted to upgrade yet. And things like that. So, but I'm hoping that'll be resolved very soon to a positive outcome, and I'll be able to upgrade that, get my connection better, and be start streaming. I'm so anxious to do this. I think it's just gonna be a lot of fun for me, it's gonna be a lot of fun for you guys, and it'll enable me to kind of play other games that I don't actually get a chance to play, which would be great. And you know, with my limited time, being able to stream as well as possibly record and then use for the videos. I mean, I just think it'll it'll maximize my time, increase my efficiency, which you know I'm all about. So hopefully that's coming soon. I hope to have an announcement in the next week or two, maybe. Uh, fingers crossed. <laughs> and uh, I'll probably be nagging some of you guys for help setting it up, because I know nothing about streaming. And I know it's kind of complicated, but I'm, I'm excited to kind of get into those nuts and bolts and figure that out as well. Um, I'm going to be starting up at least two new shows, uh, series, weekly series kind of thing. Um, and one other one uh, that I'll talk about at the, towards the, the end of this video. first one is going to be, I've actually talked about this one before, and I've looked for input, and it just never got off the ground for various reasons, but now I'm going to do it. It's going to be called Trial by Fire. Um, it's basically going to be, you guys pick the loadout, you guys pick the weapon configuration, I run it for a week, I come back to you and I give you my thoughts and my, my opinions on that. It could be silly, it could be a troll kind of setup, it could be a serious competitive setup. If you've got a gun configuration you think doesn't get enough respect, hit me up, I'll play with it for a week and I'll let you know what I think. If you think you've got a loadout that people should know about, let me know, I'll play it, I'll let you know. Um, really simple format, but basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the loadouts from the comments. So for any given video, I'm going to look at the previous video, and in the comments I'm going to just look through, see your suggestions, and I'm going to pick one that intrigues me. Um, if there's one that gets a lot of thumbs up, obviously that's going to catch my attention, I'm going to weigh that more heavily. Um, but it's really about which ones intrigue me, and kind of give me the most fun, which I think you guys will enjoy. So we're going to try to get that kicked off very soon. Um, if you guys have any loadouts, any gun, anything like that that you want to see, post in this video. I'll, I'll, I'll pay special attention to anything posted in these comments. You never know. It might be in the first episode of Trial by Fire. So look for that coming down the pipeline. Second one, uh, nothing revolutionary. I'm not innovating here at all. Um, I'm, I'm going to do a mailbag on Friday. Friday is a weird little day for me with videos. Some, sometimes you guys love my content there. Sometimes you don't really watch it, which I get it. It's Friday. People are doing other things, getting the hell out. <laughs> uh, I do too. Um, weekend, so... Uh, I, I don't want to post kind of original content there because sometimes it gets missed and, and I put some work into the stuff and, and, and it can be frustrating a little bit so I'll just I'll hold that kind of stuff over for earlier on, on a Monday and we're all stuck back in work so I have you captive and you're going to watch the videos <laughs> um, and I just figured this is a way for me to kind of interact with you guys a little more it's kind of a QA. and a it can be anything really um, again same thing you can contact me um, Twitter email through the comments um, if it's personal again you can use email Facebook anything like that any of my normal means of of contact, feel free to send a message in to me. I'll read it. If it intrigues me, it's something I want to talk about, I'll use it. Uh, it could be anything. Uh, real life, gaming, uh, anything about me personally or about uh, any news that's propped up that week, that kind of thing. I'm going to look for two or three questions. Uh, you guys know the format. A lot of people do this. Um, but I just figured it's a good way for me to interact with you guys and get let you know a little more about me. Something that I wouldn't probably make a whole video about. Now I can talk about it, give you my opinion. And again, you can see where I stand on different issues because I get a lot of you know emails and things on, on, on topical things and breaking news and, and both in the game and out of. So all that is fair game on this series. Feel free to send stuff in. Again, I will pick um, two or three questions probably. Whatever time time constraints. You know I like to talk, so it might end up just being two. And you know, all credit will be given to you unless it's personal. Then I will probably make it anonymous. Uh, we'll figure that out as we go. Probably go anonymous unless you say I can post your name. That's probably the safest way to go. I'm going to kick that off on Fridays. This way I can get you some content you guys would be interested in. And uh, this way we're all happy in that regard. If there's any breaking like Battlefield 3 news, that would be included there, of course. Now the third show that I'm kicking around and working on is a 
I hesitate to call it a podcast, a uh, podcast style show that we're going to be doing over the Company 008 channel. Um, if you guys haven't subscribed over there, go over there now, subscribe, I'll link it. Description and in oh, <laughs> description and overlay. Um, definitely make sure you subscribe over there because when it launches, you're going to want to catch that. Uh, it's going to be me hosting kind of a roundtable slash podcast, real relaxed, real casual, similar to Nerd Talk, but we're going to talk about kind of more uh, newsy stuff. Not not the bigger topics. Uh, it's going to be very casual. A couple guys sitting around maybe having drinks thing. You know, you're down at the pub, you're having a couple drinks, talking about whatever topic you're passionate about. For us, it's gaming. It doesn't necessarily have to be gaming at that point. We're going to, you know, we're working on some names, some concepts, that kind of thing. But I'm really excited to do this. I want to get some of the clowns that are in Company Series 08 front and center for you guys to kind of get to know a little better. Because we have a lot of personalities around here. And it's, it's not going to be limited to 008. We're going to invite guests on, of course. Probably going to be two to three guys per show, including myself. Maybe four. We'll see. Uh, we're going to have to find that right mix. If you guys have any suggestions, please feel free. We're, we're, like I said, we're in the kind of concept phase right now. We're working out the kinks, the names, how we're going to work it. We will not be streaming initially unless I can get my streaming stuff sorted. Probably not the first couple of episodes, but that is the goal is to stream on a regular night. Where you guys can kind of meet up with us, enjoy it. I love that back and forth that we had with Nerd Talk. I miss it. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna look to maybe start something up like that. But that that's a little further off. But I just wanted to kind of whet your appetite a little bit for that. One ping I want to put out to you guys. Um, again, I'm full of revolutionary, innovative ideas. If there's anybody out there that's kind of a graphic designer, very good with that stuff. That's um, would be interested in working with me on a project. I, I want to start doing some T-shirts and things like that. Stickers, kind of. We have a lot of kind of. Um, Mems that happen within us, uh, within our community here, that I really love to kind of put on a T-shirt, put on a sticker, just not lose it. And I think it would be really funny. It's not really about making dollars. I mean, sure. I mean, everything would help the, the community, of course. But uh, you know, I'm, I'm a funny T-shirt guy. I love them. Uh, my wife, <laughs> I drive her crazy. But if I could start getting some of these things, and, and, and you know, that happen, we just had an event that I that I could have pulled three or four different concepts out of. Um, I think it would be a lot of fun. So, obviously, uh, compensation could be discussed. I'm not looking for, you know, a free bag here. Um, but it would be something to work with me on projects ongoing where we, you know, I could come to you with a concept, we could work it out, and then we can get it on some merchandise. And hopefully sell a couple things, make a couple bucks, support some servers and things like that that we, we have operating costs. But mostly to get some funny gear out to you guys, logos and things like that. So if you are if you think it's something you could handle um, on an ongoing, long-term thing, you know, um, building a relationship basically, um, and it's something that you'd be interested in. Please hit me up um, through email is probably the best way. But anyway, Twitter, Facebook, uh, anything but private message on YouTube because those get missed. Uh, it's the worst platform. <laughs> if you want to make sure I see you, email, uh, Facebook, or Twitter. YouTube messages I check, but they're they're buggy, they're delayed, they get missed a lot. I mentioned we just did an event. Um, uh, Minecraft is taking Company 008 by storm lately. Um, Minecraft and Dota. Uh, Dota 2, I think, right? Um, as Battlefield 3 wanes right now, we're all looking towards the end game. It's a lull. We, we hit these with Battlefield 3 all the time. Um, everybody's still playing it, but right now it seems like most of the focus, uh, most of our Battlefield 3 junkies have um, developed a new habit, and that is either one or the other, or both in Ertzi's case. <laughs> Uh, Dota 2, and we've kind of been branching out between Dota 2 has been kind of the focus, a little uh, League of Legends 2, basically MoMA's, uh, just kind of playing them a little bit, and but mostly Minecraft. Minecraft is taking storm right now, last month or so, we have our own server, um, kind of invite only, so don't don't flood anybody with any requests. Um, yeah, everybody's been playing, I, I've been doing my series over my Let's Play, uh, the guys were nice enough, uh, the puppy and what was it, uh, DT just kind of put together a little competition. You guys have probably seen it if you watch a lot of Minecraft on YouTube. The Ultra Hardcore series, you've seen it with the Minecraft guys and things like that. I'm sure, I'm sure a lot of people have done it. We just tried our own version of it. It was pretty funny. Pretty uh, pretty fail-filled. <laughs> uh, yeah, Brian, I'm, I'm, I'm looking at you. Uh, starve to death. <laughs> uh, that was what I was talking about. T-shirts. Um, but yeah, it was a success. Everybody, I mean, to a man, had a, had a great time. I uh, want to do it again. We will be doing it again. As far as I understand, I'm not going to uh, volunteer those gentlemen for the job. Um, but yeah, if you haven't checked it out, go check out the puppy. And Polygon Wizards channel, I think, have the footage. I don't know if anybody else does. If they do, I will catch you up and I will add links um, if you do. Um, but they're the two guys that I've seen footage and I've watched it. Very entertaining. I will link, of course, annotations, descriptions. Go check them out. They're pretty funny. Uh, it's funny to see how like such a high-tension environment in Minecraft really can affect guys. I mean, these guys are really good at the game. And 
you're watching the footage and you're like, you're terrible. <laughs> it's because you're so stressed out, you forget things, you misclick, you make just dumb moves. Um, for those of you who don't know, basically the premise of Ultra Hardcore is um, you have to eat to not starve, but eating does not, your health bar does not regenerate. So if you lose a heart to a creeper, and then you lose one to a spider, and then you take fall damage, it, you, there's no way for you to get that back. So you have to be very, very, very careful. You have to avoid all confrontations. Um, you're not allowed to grid mine, so resources are hard to get. There's a way to regenerate health. You have to get a golden apple or a... Oh, God, what is it? Uh, something lem uh, melon. I forget what it's called. Glimmering melon or something. Really kind of hard to get. Um, and then it's PvP. You're supposed to kill each other, but I think we lacked a little PvP on the first one. The map was a little large, as what I'm hearing. I didn't take part. I hope to take part in the next one. They just they picked a bad weekend for me with my son's birthday. But it seems like it was a big success. Kudos to UDT and the puppy for all the hard work. I, I know how that can be. And anybody else that helped out, good job, guys. I'm proud of you. Good event. We will be doing it again. Um, and lastly, I just want to do a shameless plug for my Let's Play channel, Cobra Gaming. I'm having a lot of fun over there. Again, like I said, it's been a little bit of a low. Battlefield 3, I've been kind of playing out on the weekends when I can, kind of stay up late and play with the guys. Um, in between, I've been playing a lot of Minecraft. So that's going up over there. I'm building a kind of, uh, gosh, I don't even know how to describe it, a settlement city, uh, port city, that kind of thing. It's going to be a big, large, grand project, and you guys are going to watch me step by step as I go. It's, it's a Let's Play. Um, the guys have been watching it, been enjoying it. I've been enjoying doing it. It's been a lot of work, but uh, that's how I play Minecraft. That's how I enjoy it. So it's been fun. It's been good to kind of take a low stress uh, vacation away from all the shooters. I'm very much ready for Endgame. Uh, hurry up and get here. I can't believe we haven't heard a date yet. Um, yeah, once I get here, I'm going to be in it. I hope, unless it's a just it just thuds like Armored Kill, but I don't think it will. I don't think it's going to be as bad as Armored Kill. I don't think it's going to be as good as Aftermath. Frankly, it's going to fall right in the middle, and that's okay. I'll get plenty of hours out of that. And then we got to wait until Battlefield 3, but hopefully in between there uh, we'll get some Daisy standalone and stuff. But I'm going to do a video on the future, what I'm looking at, what I'm planning, because it's a long time until Battlefield 4. And uh, we'll, we'll kind of talk about that a little bit. But hopefully the streaming will really help me kind of augment everything and bring new life to maybe old things. So, otherwise, guys, I've rambled on enough, but I wanted to cover a bunch of business there. Make sure you check it all out. And thanks again, guys, for all your support. I appreciate it. I will talk to you soon. Take care. Just a reminder guys, don't miss any of my content. Clicking the big screen in the middle, that's going to take you to the Battlefield 3 playlist where you'll find a lot of videos similar to the one you just watched. The video to the lower left hand side, that's my Let's Play channel. Over there I post all kinds of Let's Plays and walkthroughs, Minecraft, Far Cry, Assassin's Creed, all kinds of different games that don't fit into the first person shooter genre. And to the lower right, make sure you do not miss the Company 008 community channel. You're going to find a lot of directors over there that post similar content to mine, so if you like my stuff, you're probably going to like theirs too. Thanks a lot, guys. Have a nice day.